Galatians 5, 22 and 23. But the fruit of the Spirit is love, joy, peace, long-suffering, gentleness, goodness, faith, meekness, temperance. Against such there is no law. The fifth fruit of the Spirit is gentleness. A gentle person is approachable. I know pastors who were not approachable. They were rough and judgmental. This kind of a person is the kind of a person that you do not want to approach for counsel the second time. There are parents who are like this. A child comes to them with a problem, and then the parent blows his stack and makes the child feel like an idiot. Here communication is broken, and the child has no one to turn to but someone outside the home. This kid is not going to come to a parent because he knows that his parent is going to create a scene. On the other hand, a gentle person is approachable. A gentle person will listen. Jesus was a gentle person. He was and is completely approachable. John 3.17 For God sent not his Son into the world to condemn the world, but that the world through him might be saved. Gentleness is a characteristic of the yielded believer. The fruit of the Spirit is the natural, effortless product of a healthy plant. The Spirit-filled person is a person who has surrendered his right to blow his stack. 2 Corinthians 10.1 Now I, Paul, myself, beseech you by the meekness and gentleness of Christ, who in presence am base among you, but being absent and bold toward you. Paul was a gentle person. His gentleness found its roots in the Lord Jesus. This verse says, Now I beseech you by the meekness and gentleness of Christ. To be filled with the Spirit is to be filled with the Spirit of Christ. The fruit of the Spirit comes out of that relationship. May the Lord bless these words to our hearts today. Complete in me, no work of mine could take, dear Lord, the place of thine. Thy blood hath poured and bought for me, and I shall stand. Complete in me, yea, justified, oh, blessed.